Hey, welcome back, my YouTube family. Welcome back to the channel. We have y'all. I'm about to show you guys a three bedroom, two bath beauty. I've been in the inside already and they got it fixed up nice. It's a nice floor plan. They got everything laid out nice. They have built ins. And it's something that you would like to see or want to see. They got a lot. Nice light skunks on the outside of the door. You got the shutters on the front of the house on the um around the windows. Let's go around the back and check it out. They got a nice big beautiful side window. They got a spot to catch the rain. If it happened to rain, you want to let up your window. This is the back. We have an outlet right here. We got glass sliding doors for the back. So come on, y'all. Let's go on the inside and check it out. Check it out with me. This spring weather, I'm loving it. So far, it ain't too hot. It ain't too cool. It's been all right with me so far. Down here in open like Alabama. All right, y'all, let's go in and check it out and see, see what we got. All righty, when you come in, this is the foyer area. We have beans in the ceiling. We have some nice little texture on the ceiling as well. We have a built-in soon as you come in. A nice, beautiful fireplace, electric. Got spots where you can hang your coat. I'm gonna do the master bathroom and the kitchen last. I'm gonna go down this hallway first. They got some nice flooring in here with the vents in the floor. Y'all, a shot of this fireplace real quick. Again, a spot for your TV. Got cubbies on the side. A stone fireplace. Looks real nice. I'm gonna swing around so y'all can see the kitchen and stuff, but I'm gonna do it last when I get ready to do the master. So they got a nice, nice ceiling fan. Get y'all a close up on that. Nice open, a lot of natural light. Look at this ceiling fan. You don't see a, a lot of mobile homes with ceiling fans like that in the living room. So that's real nice. All right, y'all. I'm gonna get to that in just a second. Just stay with me. I'll show y'all a little snippet of it, but we're gonna go this way. All right, to my left. You have the first bedroom. I really don't know the dimensions of the bedroom, but it's a nice size. Probably get you a good full size bed in here. For your children, got a closet space right here. Check out this window. I like the little accent doors, I like how, what they have, what they doing with the doors. They have the recessed lighting in this room. Okay, I know this was like this. Okay, so we have like a Jack and Jill. Have a shower and tub combo. Nice wallpaper on the back. We have the vanity right here with a little storage in the front. I hope y'all liking this. It look real good. It resets lighting all throughout the house. We 
gonna go on to this side. This room is a lot bigger than the first one. So you can get you a comfortable size clean bed in here. And have a ton of space. Let me see what your closet look like. Let's see what the closet looks like. All right, we have a little small closet in here. Not too bad, not too bad. But this is a big room. This could be like if, you, if you're single, just husband and wife or girlfriend and boyfriend, y'all can make this out of like a flex room because the closet ain't that big. Give y'all another shot and turn around. We got a nice big window in here for some natural light. All right, let's go see that kitchen. I know y'all been waiting on this, so come on. Come with me. There's those two glass sliding doors I was talking about when I was outside. You can put you a nice big porch on the back. Have some nice family time gatherings, invite people over. Check out these light switch fixtures over the island. They look real good. Y'all close up detail look on this. And they got three of them. They got three lights hanging, you know the island big. We got some storage on the island. A ton of storage. Y'all close up on this. And we gonna swing around. They got stainless steel appliances. Whirlpool. They got some cubbies over the top of the refrigerator. They got some nice countertop space with a form sink. Looks nice, looks nice. Ooh, I can open one cabinet. Let's see what we're looking at in here. Sinks look nice. Got a nice dishwasher. Cabinets go all the way up to the ceiling. I love the beams that they have in here. I ain't talking enough about the beams, but I love it. They got a nice little bar over here for, I guess, like your coffee or you want to set up your air fryer or something over here. You can do that. They got the like nice sconces on the on both sides. Give you some light at night. Got this barn door looking. I guess it's for the pantry. Let's see. Nope, not for the pantry. But this is the utility room. Washer and dryer hook up. It's a nice space. We have your breaker box inside of this room. So no pantry in this one, y'all. But you do have a ton of storage. Let me give y'all another shot. All right, let's go into this master. Let's see what we got. That's a nice touch to keep the air flowing all throughout the house. It's a nice size bedroom. I love the ceiling fan, same ceiling fan as in the living room. This nice big window. I hope y'all can tell how much space y'all have in here. It's a ton, now let's go check out this own suite. First off, we have a nice big soap tub with a window over, over the tub for that natural light. 
feel like I say a natural light a lot. <laughs> but we got some cubbies for your for your face rags and towels. Body wash and all that. And with double vanities, these and hers. Let's open the cabinet. Got the round sinks. We have a walk in with a step in shower. It don't have glass right here, but it'll be, you know, the glass open. Open down, I'm guessing, or slides. Look like they may slide open. Yeah, got two seats in here. It's a nice, nice shower. Let's check out the closet. Nice size closet. Yeah, yeah, so tell me what you guys think. Drop a like, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel for more house tours. I'll leave you guys more information about this home in the description. And I wanna thank you guys for touring the house with me and I'll catch y'all on the next one.